Hello, and welcome to 5-Minute Math. Today we are looking at the 6th grade concept of interpreting numeric data. This is standard 6.13a in the great state of Texas, and we are using item number 36 of the 2023 released STAR test. If you haven't done so already, please go ahead and take a moment to pause the video, work this problem out on your own, unpause it, and we will look at our answers together. All right, so we have a stem and leaf plot here. It shows the ages of riders on a roller coaster. And so we need to find one statement that is true, which means three statements will be false. Let's look at the stem and leaf plot real quick. Ages of riders on a roller coaster. We'll always look for your key. Sometimes they'll give you a stem and leaf plot, and it has to do with decimals. In this case, right, this three, and then the vertical line, the five, this is just going to be your tens place. That's going to be your ones place, because that's going to equal... 35. So that's pretty easy. The stem is the tens. This is the ones. Which means, look, your your lowest age is 10. You got a 10 year old here, and then your highest age is the 74. You got a 74 year old going on with a 10 year old. That's a pretty wide range there. Okay. So each of these leaves are going to stand for a an age, right? So this first row, if I wanted to write it out, would be 10, because that's that first one. And then 13, that's the second one. And I would write 14 twice, because there's my two fours. I would write 18, and I would write 19. But you see how the stem and leaf plot really condenses it down to where it's, if they're all having the same stand of, of one in the tens place, it's a lot easier to write it out like that. So that's how we would interpret that. So let's take a look at our answer selection. So we're going to find the one that is correct. There were more writers between... 10 and 38, then there were between 42 and 74. Okay, so let's figure out between 10 and 38. So we're going to include those. So between 10 and 38, I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, so I see 14 writers between 10 and 38 is going to be more than, greater than, 42 and 74. Okay, that's the rest of them. So that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Well, yeah, A looks correct. All right, so if A is going to be correct, then right, we need to go ahead and just verify that B, C, and D are going to be incorrect. A does look good. There were more writers 14 years of age than the writers of any other single age. Okay, so that is really looking for what we call the mode, right? The most popular, the most chosen. So I've got two 14s right there. Okay, so is that the mode? Is that the, the most chosen, the most popular? I don't know. Look right here. I've got three 21s. 21, 21, 21, and then 24, 27. So this is actually the mode. And yeah, so 21 is the mode, not 14, but that's fine. I'm looking to show that B, C, and D are all incorrect. So if it's incorrect, I'm fine with that. C, there were 31 riders on the roller coaster. I don't know. We just need to count how many total we have, right? I'm just going to count how many are in the leaf. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Nope, not even close, but I know where they got that from. They added that 7, right? 24 plus 7 does equal your 31, but you don't add the stems. You just add the leaves. Only the leaves represent writers. The stems help you interpret that, so that's a tricky one. And there were exactly three writers over the age of 50. Well, where's my 50? Okay, so my 50 is right here. Okay, so over the age of 50 would be 1, 2, 3. On that row, yes, that's correct. But I also have to include 62, 70, and 74. There's actually six writers over the age of 50. All right, so B, C, and D are all incorrect. That does just leave me with A. There are more writers between 10 and 38 years of age than there were between 42 and 74 years of age. 